Hi guys, Xavier Robledo, the creator of Builder Buddies, came to my town in Diamond Falls and he attracted a big crowd. He was really nice and we got to give him suggestions and ask him some questions about upcoming features, which um, cleared up some of the rumors that were flying around. Um, Diamond Falls briefly got, even got to number two in top towns, which hasn't happened in like a year. Um, our, our best without Xavier is in recent times is number three, so pretty cool. Anyway, let me share with you some of the things that we learned. I took some crude screenshots. Um, first I asked him about the animals and cars that people were saying he was going to add. He says, I do plan to add animals and cars, but realistically not this year. So it is on the list, but we're going to have to wait. Um, then I asked him about day and night cycle, which is another hot item people are asking about. That's on my to-do list, but not this year, he says. And he said, I'm going to try and get a skin editor this year. Which sounds interesting. Someone asked him about banning. He says, I'm the only person that can ban. Um, and I asked him about plot sharing, which I've been asking for over a year. He says, I know plot sharing is important, but not this year. So that's kind of disappointing and it's put off even more. But there's, there is stuff coming here. I asked, um, you know, what is coming? He said, this year expect wool, clothes, and a skin editor. So that's what we can expect this year. Wool, clothes, and a skin editor. Um, he says, here's some personal notes. I've had to slow down how much I work due to health issues, but I'm getting better. But there's a chance I'll need surgery this year. So, and if that happens, then I don't know how much I'll get done. So let's, let's pray that he stays healthy and can keep the game going. Um, as... Zainab asked Xavier, how does a skin editor work? He says, I don't have it all planned out yet. In general, I want you guys to your own games. Um, that means you can make skins, texture packs, etc. Someday, maybe even your own music. Um, this is, let me go back a slide here. Uh, tools and pets are on the to-do list. We already know that. Um, let's see, when skin editor is done, you can set your own price. I'll take a tax out of it, though. Um, and then he asked, what price do you think wool should be? So he's thinking about changing wool prices. Um, I asked some more about the editor. He says, Termite, they will design and sell skins, not clothes. So it's a skin editor. Um, I'll think about wool prices. We're sort of dovetailing two things here. Um, could you make Thor? Termite, a skin is like a Minecraft skin. You get to control all pixels on character body. So I asked, I could make myself a termite character, and he said, yes, you can termite. So this sounds really cool. It's, so it sounds like he's taking a lot of cues from Minecraft. I'm speculating that maybe you'll be able to design something, submit it to him for approval, and then he'll put it in like a store of submitted things similar to what Minecraft does, which is a genius idea, and it, um, it offloads some of the work onto... Builder Buddies fans to, to create a lot more content. Plus, it may even skirt the copyright issue about you know using you know superheroes and copyrighted characters. We'll, we'll see. It should be interesting. I'm not going to raise free gold, but I'm thinking about wool prices. So we don't know what those prices will be. But he may change them. Here's something I will add buddy list at some point. 
This will be interesting. I'm guessing next year. Um, I plan to add many more wool colors soon. Um, I'm thinking of having 32 total wool colors. That should be really cool and interesting. Opens up a lot of possibilities. <laughs> of course, people are saying, ah, oh, we need more inventory spaces. Um, but he goes on with the wool. I will probably redo some existing ones. Some current colors are ugly. Um, I think we've known that for a long time and are surprised he hasn't changed them yet. <laughs> okay, all gotta go. Nice chatting with you all. Okay, there we go, straight from the source. We'll be looking forward to those uh, um, features in Builder Buddies for 2018 and beyond. Hey guys, quick addendum. Um, Xavier came back to Diamond Falls the following afternoon, uh, mainly to check up on things. He just uh, changed some of the color shades for the existing wool colors and added four new wool colors. Um, you can see the much brighter cyan there, day glow green. He probably just wanted to make sure everything was looking all right few things got messed up. It looks like Ariana needs some work. Um, not too much more in the way of news. Um, my vice mayor asked Xavier, the boys need shorts, please. And he said, I will add shorts for boys. No time frame given, but we know he's going to add more clothes this year. So hopefully this year. And um, Cool Murderer asks, are you going to add tools? And he says, I will add tools, but no time frame given. That's pretty much it. Um, okay, all got to go by. Send me a direct message if you have more to say. And if you know, want to know how to contact him, direct message, um, I will show you. Go pause the game, help and support. Up here in the corner, contact us. Put, type in your email address and a description and then you can send him a message um, he also uses Instagram to post announcements and sometimes people put comments on his Instagram so that's another way to contact him alright have fun with the game take care